first and most important thing about surviving in the wild is finding water. Your body will begin to shut down after just a few days without anything to drink. Let's go find some. You see, it can be tricky finding water in certain places, but you just gotta know where to look. It can be anywhere, so you've got to look everywhere. Just what I was looking for. Safe to drink. It's exactly what I needed to keep moving forward. One of the most important things about surviving in the wild is knowing how to build a fire. Building a fire starts with finding the perfect wood. You can't just find this wood anywhere. Some of the best places to look are um, right on the ground after a rainstorm, uh, in a river, generally where it's muddy. Those are the best places. Let's go find some wood. There's a perfect piece of wood right here. And now we start. Oh, it's all a little bit of smoke. And that's how you start a fire. This only took me about 10 minutes, and it's a good thing I started when I did. Up here in the tropical Alaskan wilderness, the sun will go down on you in an instant. But it doesn't matter, because with one of these, you can start a fire anywhere. But enough of that, we need to keep moving. There we go, perfect, perfect. So my third and final tip for this episode is to always, always watch out for wild animals. One of the most ferocious animals in this neck of the woods is called the domesticated house cat. Weighing in at an astonishing 5.3 pounds, this thing will use its razor sharp teeth and its sharp claws to just tear you to pieces. What was that? Oh! Oh! oh, barely made it out of that one alive. It's what you call a close encounter. That's it for today's episode. We'll see you next time.